really pleasant out right now, especially here over the Denver area, west into the mountains, still dealing with some moisture in areas of dense fog over the eastern plains. But overall, a really pretty morning, as you can see from our camera out at Winter Park and downtown Denver. If you head out across the eastern plains this morning, we will continue to see some areas of fog. But also keep in mind, rivers continue to be very high, dangerous into portions of the high countries we've been telling you about all morning as the snow continues to melt off of our mountain peaks. This is the live look right now near Burlington from our Vier a wireless camera, some limited visibility with an area of dense fog. Uh, that fog advisory in place until 9 o'clock this morning, and then that'll eventually dissipate through mid morning and early afternoon. Temperatures right now are in the high 50s, Fort Collins and Greeley. A cool morning out west. Dillon over Berthet Pass, low 40s currently, and only 36 in Copper Mountain. Temperatures in the 50s and low 60s across the eastern plains. Here's a look ahead at our metro area planner for this Sunday. Any outdoor plans you have for the first half of the day? Just a mix of sun and clouds here for the metro area by noon 74 and high slightly cooler near seasonal normals today will be in the low 80s Highlands Ranch out to the airport up through Platteville with 60s and 70s into many of our mountain towns. But we are again talking about the chance for scattered showers and a few thunderstorms mainly after 2 p.m. over higher terrain and that activity will spread over the I-25 corridor around 3 o'clock highs this afternoon. We're looking at 70s over the eastern plains, but into the mountains it's actually going to be warmer near Steamboat and Eagle low to mid 80s and some big heat over the western slope in Grand Junction at 96 for this afternoon. Our storm outlook for today, a marginal risk of seeing a strong storm or two risk of severe weather, though at least today is lower, especially over the eastern plains. Here's a look ahead at our statewide future cast, some lingering cloud coverage in areas of fog out east, increasing cloud coverage by noon and our best chance for picking up more moisture first starting over higher terrain near Leadville, rolling over our Sangre de Cristo Mountains and here in Denver. It's right around 5 o'clock. We are expecting some wet conditions with pockets of moderate to even heavy rainfall rolling through some small hail could be associated with a few of those stronger cells that form. So wet weather possible through the evening hours and early tomorrow morning a little more cloud coverage to start the day. Temperatures will be back to the 80s for Monday and again another round of thunderstorms likely in the late afternoon and early evening hours. Looking ahead at our super seven day forecast have a plan B you hear that rumble of thunder make sure you make your way indoors stay safe out there today and tomorrow with thunderstorms likely in the afternoon overnight lows fall to the 50s by Tuesday morning. More sunshine, a few storms possible, and then some hot and dry conditions expected. Wednesday and Thursday, low 90s returning.